Hey there guys, this is Jay, Out Jay from Jay Outdoor 7. I saw a bunch of videos online about uh, everyone's everyday carry or EDC, so I thought why not make a video about that. And so here's what I carry around on a day-to-day -day basis when I leave the house. First thing I have with me is going to be my keys. Uh, just nothing too special on here. This is my car key, house key. I do have a key bar, so I have my keys on here like a pocket knife. That's pretty nice. Expensive, but nifty. And I also have a little peanut lighter on here for a spare in case my regular lighter doesn't want to work. It's a, it was cheap, 10 bucks, but it's tiny. It's a convenient to carry around. It works. I mean, what you can ask for, you need to get a fire lit, that'll do the job. Uh, let's see, find a carabiner on here in case uh, someone gives you more keys, like uh, to the gun club or the army or whatever. You just snap them on there and won't lose them then. Works for me. Next thing I have is my wallet. I uh, have my identification, my care permits, uh, insurance cards, credit cards, all that stuff in here. All stuff you want to have on you on a daily basis is right in here. It's fairly flat, comfortable to carry around. has for like 10 years. It held up really well. So, yeah. Don't know where, don't know where I got it from, but it works nice. Uh, for my knife, I carry a Mora Elderus. It's a nice little knife. It's an awesome little knife, actually. It's very small and compact. It's, you forget you have it on you. It's easy to carry around. But the handle is awesome. If you look at this, this handle fills up my hand perfectly. Like, I have a good grip on there. I can use this to carve all kinds of stuff. Um, I see people with tactical folders, like they're going to get into a knife fight or something. Like, that's not going to help you if you really need to use a knife. You need to carve a spoon, carve a tool, make a fire, prepare kindling, stuff like that. Something like that's not going to be, it, it might work, but it's not going to be as useful or comfortable to use as this. You can use this all day long and not have any problems, no hot spots, no blisters. One of those knives going to be difficult, and plus I don't ever anticipate getting into a knife fight. I I, I say the first rule of knife fighting is don't get into knife fights, honestly. Uh, I, I want to say every knife fight I've ever heard of occurring, anywhere, both people get stabbed. Even if there's only one knife involved, both people get stabbed. You don't want to get into a knife fight, that's what you carry a gun for. And also on my knife sheath I have a lighter. This is an Exotac Titan Light. It's literally the best lighter I've ever had. It's uh, it's expensive, but it's uh, it's very nice. It stays completely sealed, so you don't have to worry about um, the fluid leaking out. It's going to be good for you for years. This one right here, actually, I filled up three years ago, and it still works. So you just saw it light up. That was I've been filled for quite a long time. This one I filled up maybe four weeks ago, testing it out. But yeah, it's an awesome lighter. See, it's got a nice big long base, so if you have to build a fire, get your butt lighter on in there. Lights up very nicely. Nice big flame. Awesome little lighter. I used to have a ferro rod in this knife, but I realized a long time ago, a ferro rod's... I mean, they work, but they take time to use. If you need fire right now, it's a ferro that's not going to do it for you. If you want to light someone's cigarette, if you want to light a candle on a birthday cake, something like that, that's not going to be good for you. You want to, be able to, you want to get fire immediately. A ferro not going to do that for you. For my carry gun, I carry a Chiappa Rhino 200DS and 40 Smith & Wesson. Uh, this has been an awesome carry gun. Uh, there are some things I don't like about it, but outside of that, it works very well. I'm not crazy about the sights. If you can see the sights on there, they're very, they're they're hard to pick up. They're they're not as easy to pick up as my full size Rhino, which I love that gun. This is my wintertime carry gun. I carry this in the wintertime in the pocket because when you have two sweatshirts and a jacket zipped up, it's hard to get to your waistband to pull out of the waistband. So it goes in my front pocket. Fits very nicely in there. It's been accurate. It's been convenient, fun to shoot, easy to carry. Overall, good carry gun. Moon clip of 40 Smith & Wesson, it'll do the job. And here's a little bit extra ammo. I'll carry usually two reloads with me at all times when I leave the house. And then an alibi, my summertime carry. Up oh, there's my kitten. <laughs> hey, Kiernan, what are you doing? Come on now. Get beat, we're playing with guns. All right, my uh, summertime carry gun is my full-size Chiappa Rhino in 357 Magnum. It's an awesome little gun. Well, not really little, but an awesome gun. It uh, holds uh, six rounds, very easy to shoot, very controllable. I had this gun out today. I was holding, I want to say, every shot I fired double action at 25 yards on a chest size silhouette hit every time. I moved that to 50 yards. I have like four out of six, usually. It's a long distance for a pistol. But honestly, this gun is awesome. I love this gun. Things I don't like about it, I don't like this rail on here. That's annoying. I, I don't see it myself ever putting a light or anything on here. These sights are awesome. Um, I wish I had a little bit of a shorter barrel so it would fit in my pocket. That's why I got this one here. This one doesn't fit in my pocket. 
And honestly, if Kiapa ever gets off its ass and makes a three inch run with a three inch barrel, no rail, and fiber optic sights like on here, I'll buy that all day long. It's an awesome little gun. That might replace these two if they ever make that, but it's doubtful at this point. Um, so yeah, that's really all I carry on me on a daily basis. Uh, handles all my regular tasks. Anything else I'd need, such as a multi-tool or a, a larger knife or whatever, that would be in my uh, car, inside my uh, get-home bag. Everything else, I am just have this. Handles all my tasks. If you have any questions uh, or a comment, please leave it below. Thanks for watching.